Hello everyone, welcome back to Azure SQL Mastery. In this video series, we will see how to migrate our on-premises database server to Azure. Let's first discuss the agenda. Here, first we will discuss about the migration tool and second, we will see the demo. So migration tool. So uh, there are uh, five methods to migrate our on-premises database to Azure. The tools are a SQL Server Management Studio, Manual Backpack File, DMA Data Migration Assistant, Transaction Replication and Azure Database Migration Services. So you can choose any of this method to migrate your own premises database to Azure. It depends on your database size and the downtime required to migrate. Thank you very much. See you in a demo. Welcome to the demo. Uh, in this demo, we will migrate our on-premises database to Azure. So this is my local server 192.16. And the instance name is SQL Inbox. So this is my a local database. And this is my Azure server. So right now I I don't have any database in Azure machine. Okay, so let's, uh, uh, I'm here, I'm selecting the Adventure Work 2017, right click, go to the task, and then select the Deploy Database to Microsoft Azure SQL Database. So th through this wizard, we are moving our local database to Azure. So click on Next button, click on Connect button, give your Azure server name, uh, login name password and click on connect button after that i am not going to change any of this setting but there are a service tier basic service tier standard service tier premium service tiers business critical so i go with right now the basic edition of the database uh, the maximum database size you can select here i'm go with the one one gb is enough because adventure work is around 300 mb database and i am going to click on next and finish so now this entire process will take a time based on your database size again this is not a recommended method to migrate your local database to azure if your database size is huge and and if you require a short downtime so now the operation is completed. Let's quickly connect the Azure SQL database and check. Okay, so this is my Azure SQL database server. Let's click on connect button. Okay. Refresh the database. Okay, so adventure work now successfully moved from a local database. So now let's run the query so select star from person or person this is my azure sql database so in this demo we have successfully migrated adventure work database from local database to azure so in the next video we will migrate our on premises database to azure through backpack method so see you in the next video. Thank you.